Okay, RC Air Shenanigans here. Uh, Steve had an accident with his A10. It's, uh, it no longer exists, so we got a new one. The new one has the Avian Smart ESCs, the dual 40 amp ESC. And we are going to program a reverse thrust on the new A10. So to get this far, what we've done is we've pulled the six screws out. There's two short screws, two long screws, two short screws. Take those screws out, pull the nacelles off. They might be a little stuck from the paint, but trust me, that's it. They're not, it's not glued on. It just comes off. You got your two little wires right here, one for each ESC. So you're going to need an ESC programmer. They're somewhere between 30 and 45 bucks from Horizon Hobby. And we're just going to plug in each ESC and show you the steps. It's super easy. There's like really three steps. Gray wire is your signal. Gray wire is the signal wire. And you can see ESC, negative, positive signal. Yeah, sometimes that's a pain. Here, let me back up for you. You put your hand in my light and I can't see. Yeah, that. so that's my bad. Hit select to connect to your ESC. Initializing. Brake type. You want to hit edit to reverse and then hit save. Then select brake force. Uh, we're going to put that at 7, save. And then I think from here we just select all the way to the channel. This is the most important part. Make sure that you assign this to the proper channel because if you're using safe, safe defaults to channel 7, auxiliary 2. So what you don't want to have is when you go into safe on the transmitter suddenly the plane goes into reverse thrust you don't you don't want that that's bad we're going to go to the other esc do the exact same thing when you're done you don't have to do anything just unplug it yep there's no like escape menu connecting esc select oops we'll come oh. back to that one yeah so break force seven save thrust reverse channel 8 and if you make a mistake and go too far you just cycle through again with this with the select button reverse save and we should be good we disconnect we're gonna screw the nacelles back on you have to disconnect the battery and then reconnect the battery uh, I believe for it to initialize here. Let me g give you a hand. I'll pull on the, the battery cable to suck those ESCs in and Yeah, a little bit more. Oh a little, little more That's about all we're getting okay. Oh, that was my bad. I'll hold it Okay, unplugged the battery seconds to kind of redo its thing Boop. plug the battery back in i'm gonna come around and i'm gonna hold the plane oh here let's show you the transmitter real quick uh what you want to do is go into the channel assign and you want to make sure that channel eight is set to auxiliary three right there and on the config you want to set whatever switch it doesn't have to be switch g but that's I, I personally myself, I have mine on switch uh, E or F. Yeah, one of these two times. F on on the NX8. It's 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 this switch right here. But yeah. Anyway. Yeah, that's forward. That's really forward. Okay. Reverse again. Perfect.